So this video is for those who think that is a wise idea not to pressure test your pipe before you put it between concrete or between sheetrock or inside concrete and between sheetrock, right? So for those who think it's a good idea, trust me, it's not, right? Especially when you're dealing with these uh, female adapters or male adapters, anything with treading, with treaded or uh, screw looking thing once they're dealing with that type of stuff that's something that i always fear i always kind of like really check and make sure uh it's not leaking right so you're going to see the damage that this uh the person probably didn't check it properly right so this is what it caused so it's, it's got water been running dripping for probably years and and this what caused the sheetrock to um damage that damage the sheetrock damage the metal thing framing and all that type of stuff right water is under the tile and everywhere as you can see it's kind of like mildewing and all that type of stuff right so this is the back wall of the shower so the shower is on the other side and this is like the closet this is the closet side that i went in to work on that pipe, right? Because you know you don't want to go and take the tires off and all that type of stuff. So you know, the good thing is sheetrock easier for you to just um, fix it. So as what I say, man, if um if you're building a house and um you you don't have any water supply there, make sure your plumber come with like if even a barrel with some water and a pump and put pressure test to the line everywhere just check all the lines make sure put the pressure to it for a while make sure it's not leaking usually you don't have to worry about like the part that you're going to put like the pipe cement um once you do it correctly uh that part is not going to leak right and you give you give it enough time for it to dry but um yeah those treaded thing right there problem you have to know how much um, um, Teflon tape or treaded tape you're going to put on it and it, it, it's, it's very it varies because sometimes you might screw something inside something and it's loose and some stuff is more tight so I don't like to put a lot of stuff on something that's already tight I put a lot on something that's loose so yeah so um, definitely man um, coming to the end of the video make sure you are check pressure test make sure everything is good before you have these things buried uh, between some wall right